All right, still at the scene. Come to a few more conclusions. Yeah, we brought the sniffers out. Look at him sniffing. Got that one, and I got that sniffer. Still trying to get to the bottom of this case and these scuffs. Here's what I found so far, what I think may have happened. <clears throat> I think an, a large ape escaped from the nearby Wapapillo Zoo, came running down the driveway, as apes do, lost his or her footing here, flew through the air like an aerodynamic homing missile, fell body first and skidded. Now, after analyzing these scuff marks, I found the gravel smells like chewing tobacco, fireball whiskey, and cheap cologne. So it may not have been an ape after all. It may have been a human. And what's weird is we found no hair on the scene. So I can only assume it's a bald human. By the depth of the scuff marks, I'm thinking 250 to 300 pounds. And maybe we're in a NASCAR style t-shirt, but maybe not NASCAR, maybe a concert t-shirt that looks like a NASCAR. Oh, looks like the, the sniffing dogs found something. What'd you bring me, boy? Did you bring me some evidence? Yeah? Oh, yep, he's confirming. It's tobacco smell, all right, and fireball. What else? What else did you find? Yeah, okay, 350, 350 pounds. Well, okay, a little more than what I expected. A little more than the 250 to 300 that I expected, but uh, tobacco no hair fireball whiskey we're getting we're getting there folks we're we're honing down on some suspects i'll be back with you when we find something else